Passion Travel is a channel specializing in all things travel street food and subscribe. Tacos. Tacos are perhaps the most iconic Mexican street food. They consist of a tortilla filled with various ingredients such as grilled meat, like carne asada or al pastor, barbacoa, slow-cooked meat, carnitas, fried pork, or even vegetarian options like grilled cactus, nopales. Tacos are one of Mexico's most beloved and iconic street foods, known for their delicious and diverse range of fillings and flavors. These versatile treats consist of a tortilla, usually corn or flour, folded or rolled around a variety of ingredients. Here's an overview of tacos and some common types. Basic components. Tortilla. Tacos can be made with either soft corn tortillas or soft flour tortillas, depending on regional preferences. Both types have their unique characteristics. Protein. Tacos can be filled with a wide range of proteins, including carne asada, grilled, thinly sliced beef marinated in spices, al pastor, spit grilled pork, often seasoned with achiote and pineapple, carnitas, slow cooked, crispy pork, pollo, seasoned and grilled or stewed chicken, barbacoa, slow cooked, tender beef or lamb, often cooked in an underground pit, pescado, Grilled or fried fish, commonly used in fish tacos. Cameron. Shrimp, often grilled or sautéed with spices. Birria. Spicy, stewed meat, typically beef or goat. Toppings and condiments. Tacos are typically garnished with a variety of toppings and condiments, including salsa. A range of salsas, from mild to hot, is used to add flavor and heat. Onions and cilantro. Chopped onions and fresh cilantro add freshness and crunch. Lime. Lime wedges are provided to squeeze over the tacos for a citrusy kick. Radishes. Thinly sliced radishes are a common accompaniment. Cheese. Grated cheese, such as queso fresco or cotija, may be added to some tacos. Guacamole or avocado. Creamy avocado or guacamole can be used for richness. Sour cream. Some tacos are topped with a dollop of sour cream or Mexican crema. Pickled vegetables. Pickled jalapenos, onions, or carrots are used for added tang and heat. Tamales. Tamales are steamed pockets of masa, corn dough, filled with a variety of fillings, including meats, cheeses, vegetables, or even sweet ingredients like chocolate or fruit. Tamales are a beloved and iconic Mexican dish made from masa, a dough made from corn, that is typically filled with various ingredients, wrapped in corn husks, and then steamed or boiled. They have a rich history and are an integral part of Mexican and Latin American cuisine. Here's more about tamales. Key components. Masa. The masa is the foundation of tamales. It is made from dried corn that has been soaked in an alkaline solution, nixtamalization, which softens the corn and allows it to be ground into a dough. This dough is then mixed with various ingredients to create the desired texture and flavor. Filling. Tamales can be filled with a wide range of ingredients, depending on regional and personal preferences. Common fillings include meats like shredded chicken, pork, beef, or cheese. Vegetarian fillings may include beans, vegetables, or even sweet fillings like chocolate or fruit. Corn husks. The filled masa is wrapped in softened and dried corn husks, which provide structural support and impart a subtle corn flavor to the tamales. Seasonings. Tamales are seasoned with a variety of spices and ingredients, including chili powder, cumin, garlic, and more, depending on the recipe and regional variations. Varieties of tamales. Tamales rojos. These tamales are often filled with red chili sauce and shredded meat, resulting in a spicy and flavorful dish. Tamales verde. Green chili sauce and green ingredients, like tomatillos and cilantro, are used for these tamales, providing a tangy and mildly spicy flavor. Tamales dulces. Sweet tamales are filled with ingredients like chocolate, cinnamon, fruit, or sweetened coconut, making them a popular choice for dessert. Oaxaqueños. From the Oaxaca region of Mexico, these tamales are known for their large size and unique fillings, often including mole and ingredients like chicken and cheese. Tamalitos. These are smaller tamales, often served as appetizers or snacks. They can be filled with a variety of ingredients. Elote. Grilled corn on the cob slathered with mayonnaise, cheese, chili powder, and lime juice is a popular street food snack. Elote, also known as Mexican street corn, is a popular and iconic street food in Mexico and other parts of Latin America. It features grilled or boiled ears of corn slathered with a variety of flavorful toppings, 
creating a savory and slightly spicy treat. Elote is beloved for its delicious combination of sweet, smoky, and savory flavors. Here's how elote is typically prepared. Ingredients. Corn. Fresh, sweet corn on the cob is the primary ingredient for elote. It can be grilled or boiled until tender. Mayonnaise. Creamy mayonnaise is spread generously over the cooked corn, serving as a base for other toppings. Katija cheese. Crumbled katija cheese, a salty and crumbly Mexican cheese, is sprinkled over the mayonnaise-covered corn. Katija adds a salty and tangy flavor to the elote. Chili powder or tahine. Chili powder, tahine seasoning, a popular Mexican chili lime seasoning blend, or a combination of both are dusted over the corn to provide a mild to spicy kick and a zesty citrusy tang. Lime wedges. Fresh lime wedges are often served with elote, allowing you to squeeze fresh lime juice over the corn for added acidity and brightness. Optional extras. Some variations of elote include adding minced cilantro, chopped green onions, or a drizzle of hot sauce for extra flavor. Preparation. Cook the corn. Grill the corn on a barbecue or cook it in boiling water until it's tender and fully cooked. Spread mayonnaise. Once the corn is cooked, spread a generous layer of mayonnaise all over each ear of corn. The mayo will help the other ingredients stick to the corn. Add cheese and chili. Sprinkle the crumbled katija cheese over the mayo-covered corn. Next, dust the corn with chili powder, tahine, or both, to your desired level of spiciness. Garnish with lime. Serve the elote with lime wedges on the side so that people can squeeze fresh lime juice over their corn. Optional extras. If desired, garnish with minced cilantro, chopped green onions, or a drizzle of hot sauce. Elote is typically served on a stick or with the husk still attached, making it easy to hold and eat as you enjoy its delectable combination of flavors. Whether enjoyed at a street food stand or prepared at home, Elote is a delightful snack that showcases the bold and savory flavors of Mexican cuisine. Esquites. Similar to elote but served in a cup, esquites are kernels of corn mixed with mayonnaise, cheese, and spices. Esquites are a popular Mexican street food dish that consists of cooked kernels of corn, maize, that are removed from the cob and typically served in a cup. Esquites are seasoned with a flavorful mixture of spices, condiments, and toppings, creating a delicious and savory snack. This dish is similar to elote, Mexican street corn, but the corn is removed from the cob for easier eating. Here's how esquites are typically prepared. Ingredients. Corn. Fresh or frozen corn kernels are used to make esquites. They are often pre-cooked or boiled before being used in the dish. Seasonings. Esquites are seasoned with a flavorful mixture that includes ingredients such as mayonnaise. Creamy mayonnaise is used to add richness and moisture to the corn. Crema. Mexican crema, similar to sour cream, is often used to provide creaminess and a slightly tangy flavor. Chili powder or tahine. Chili powder or tahine seasoning, a popular Mexican chili lime seasoning blend, adds a spicy kick and zesty citrusy flavor. Katija cheese. Crumbled katija cheese, a salty and crumbly Mexican cheese, provides a savory and tangy element. Lime juice. Fresh lime juice adds acidity and brightness to the dish. Salt. To taste. Optional toppings. Chopped cilantro. Fresh cilantro leaves add a burst of freshness and color. Chopped green onions. Thinly sliced green onions can be added for extra flavor and texture. Hot sauce. Some people like to drizzle hot sauce over their esquites for additional heat. Chopped jalapenos. If you enjoy spice, you can add chopped pickled jalapenos for a kick. Semitas. A type of sandwich made with a sesame seed covered roll filled with various meats, avocado, cheese, and chipotle sauce. Semitas are a type of Mexican sandwich that originated in the state of Puebla, Mexico. These sandwiches are known for their distinctive ingredients and flavors, and they have gained popularity both in Mexico and beyond. Here's what you need to know about semitas. Key components. Sesame seed roll. Semitas are typically made with a specific type of bread known as a semita roll. These rolls are characterized by their white, soft, and slightly sweet bread with a generous topping of sesame seeds. The roll is an essential component that gives semitas their unique texture and flavor. Meat. The most common filling for semitas is a choice of grilled or breaded meat, such as melanesa, breaded and fried beef or chicken cutlet, carne asada, grilled steak, carnitas, slow-cooked pork, or adobo-marinated pork or beef. 
Some variations may include multiple types of meat in one sandwich. Oaxacan cheese. Samitas are traditionally made with casillo, a stringy, semi-soft cheese from Oaxaca, Mexico. The cheese adds a creamy and slightly tangy element to the sandwich. Avocado. Slices of ripe avocado are a common ingredient in samitas, contributing a creamy and fresh texture. Chipotle sauce. A spicy and smoky chipotle pepper sauce is a key condiment in samitas, providing a flavorful kick. The level of spiciness can vary, so it's often adjusted to individual preferences. Popolo. Popolo is a type of herb used in samitas that has a distinct and pungent flavor. It is often compared to cilantro but with a more intense and peppery taste. Popolo adds a unique and aromatic element to the sandwich. Onions and salsa. Sliced onions and a fresh salsa, usually made with tomato, onion, and sometimes jalapenos, are commonly added to samitas for additional flavor and crunch. Variations. Samitas can come in various forms and combinations of meats and ingredients. Some popular variations include Samita de Milanesa, featuring a breaded and fried cutlet of beef or chicken. Samita de carne asada, highlighting marinated grilled steak. Samita de carnitas, filled with tender, slow-cooked pork. Samita de pierna, made with seasoned and roasted pork leg. Samita de pollo, featuring grilled or breaded chicken. Samita de adobo, filled with marinated and grilled or roasted pork or beef.